hey everyone in this video i am going to show you how you can create this sticky animation using framer all without writing a single line of code i'm imran from cycloto and let's get started before we begin i found this animation on a site built with webflow that instantly made me think why not try recreating it in framer so that's exactly what i did I'll drop the link to that website in the description so you can check it out. I'm also going to provide a free remix link in the description so you can customize it yourself. All I ask is that you hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Now let's jump in. First of all, let's change the name to Sticky Animation Tutorial. Now press F on your keyboard to add a frame. Go to layers and double click on it. Name it container. Go to desktop and click this layout to make it stack. Change the height to feet. Click this container, set the width fill and change the height to 6000 pixel click this layout to make it stack scroll down and remove this fill color we will add fill color later next inside this container add another frame and name it images or all images this is where we will upload all our images click this container click this direction to horizontal and align it start now click this frame click this layout to make it stack and change the width to fill and we will set the height later now let's upload all our images by the way you can find all the images in the assets panel it's here this is where you can find all the images and select all the images drop into the all images click this frame change the direction to vertical now let's change the height to viewport and distribute start remove this fill color and arrange the images accordingly i'll wrap each images into a frame by pressing ctrl alter enter or command option return on mac rename the frame accordingly now select this frame to this frame and change the height to viewport 100 vh now press Control alt enter again to wrap it into another stack and name it wrapper let's add a background color here scroll down go to the fill I'm not exactly copying their background because this video isn't focused on creating a gradient background so instead I'm using a simple background with conic gradient click here and add three more fill and change the fill color for the first one this for the second one this Pause the video 
and see the hex code here. Now comes the fun part. Adding animations to our project. First, click on the first image frame. Scroll down. Click this scroll section. And name it one. Now do the same for the second frame. Name it two. Repeat the process for the third, fourth, fifth, sixth, and seventh frame. Now select the first image frame again. Go to Effect, Scroll Transform, Trigger Section in View. Leave the viewport like this. Bottom, select the section two. Go to the from state and increase the opacity to 1, scale it to 1. Go to the two state and decrease the opacity to 0 0.8. Now copy this and select the second, third, fourth, fifth and sixth. For the last frame, leave it as is. No animation is needed there and right click on your mouse paste paste effect now manually go to the second frame scroll and change the section to 3 now for the third section change it to 4 5 6 7 now let's preview it to see how it looks it's not working as expected it's because when we implement scroll animations we need to ensure that the parent layers frame overflow is set to visible so the parent sections are wrapper all images container desktop now change the overflow to visible let's preview it again to see still it's not working let's fix it actually we have to make the position to sticky but for some weird reason when we make the section sticky the height change to 14 vh so change it to 100 vh now do the same for the second and rest of the frame Let's preview it again to see. Yes, it's working perfectly. So this is how you can easily create a sticky animation using Framer. Again, I'll leave the Remix link in the description. So feel free to check it out. Also, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. That's been it. I'll see you in the next video inshallah.